Good afternoon guys, this is Maya. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. So in this video, we are going to learn how to rename the rooms. So I have a sample project here. First, I would show you the whole project. Uh, this one, this one I did it for my friend. So we have a living room in the entrance with the dining area and here we have one bedroom this one this is a kids bedroom basically this one is a storage this is washroom this is a kitchen area This is the master bedroom. With the attached with the attached WC. Okay. So we have here totally one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, eight rooms basically. So so now go to this display options and here you can see this icon showroom designations click on this one and you can see it is appearing like room 3 room 5 you can see it here also room 4 room 5 room 7 8 9 3 and 2 so what happens is when it's written as rooms generally when we do calculations and when we are doing a report uh, sometimes we may get confused okay, which which room is this so it's always preferable to change the name of the room so now we'll just change it first step here is go to this view project overview and you can see here all the rooms and stories so site one under site one i have building one and building one i have story one so to change on anything just double click on that one so this is building one I'll just click on backspace okay now I can name the residence okay suppose uh, this is my MZ residence so I'll keep it here MZ residence okay and story is nothing but the first and second floor double click on this one click on backspace and make it as first floor right okay then luminous windows nothing to change here and here you can see room 2 room 3 room 5 and all when i click on this room 2 you can see this blue color have been turned into sky blue in color just click on this one and this is my master bedroom so i'm going to name it as master bedroom okay fine now you can see this appears master bedroom okay next my room three this one is wc i'll just make it as wc if you want you can keep the name as short you can keep it as m bedroom meaning that it's a master bedroom And room 4 is my living area and dining. You can keep it as here living plus dining. Then room 5 is my children's bedroom. C bedroom. Room 7 is my storeroom so store room and then room 8 is my wc again so I, if i have two wc i can name it as wc1 and wc2 then room 9 is my utility area okay so i have named all my rooms 
you can go and check it in the documentation though i have not calculated anything but still just to show you guys here you can see here whatever changes i made have been saved in the report also mz residence first floor and the rooms and the rooms respectively so the advantage of naming the room is when you have too many rooms if you name it you can just without any confusion just click on this one and generate the reports so i'll go back to the construction and if you want to make the text layer off go back to this one and just hide this one okay control s and that's it whatever the changes you made okay uh, that will be appearing here also see mz residence building name story as a first floor and you can view the room separately like if you go on here you can see master bedroom wc living dining c bedroom store room wc2 and utility room and you will enter the room you have selected so this is my master bedroom okay suppose you want to go on to other room you can just click it again to the drop down menu and say now i want to go to the children's bedroom and here is my children's bedroom okay similarly you can select any bedroom or any area you want to go living and dining so this is living and dining and now if you want to exit this room you can just select the first floor and your whole plan will be visible in the side view ceiling will be visible so you can select the story mode so this is it guys this is how you name the rooms okay you can just use this option showroom dimensions and it will be visible Hope you find this video helpful. If you did, please, please hit the thumbs up and stay and subscribe to my channel and stay connected to explore more and dialogues with me. Thank you.